good morning everybody good morning it's past 5 a.m in the morning and uh, as you can see from my face i just woke up about 10 minutes ago getting ready for work yes i am the only person awake as of now in my house everywhere is so silent because they are all sleeping maybe my husband is a little bit awake but uh, he's still in bed anyway so guys today's video is going to be all about taking you guys to my workplace show you guys what i do for a living how i do my work i hope you enjoyed today's video come along with me at my workplace and then let's spend the day together okay i have to be at work by 6 a.m so i have to wake up every day by 5 10 yeah because it takes about 40 minutes for me to get to my workplace if I am lucky, because on a normal day, before this pandemic started, it, it it normally takes about even an hour or so for me to get to work. So, and since I start at uh, 6 a.m. in the morning, I have to be out of my house at least 5.20 latest, 5.20 a.m. in the morning. So, guys, let's go. Let me go to the fridge and take my water and then some of the fruits I'll be having for breakfast. This is going to be my breakfast, watermelon and uh, yellow melon. So guys, this is where I work. I just arrived right now. If you take a look at that uh, written very well, it's written FedEx TNT. Yeah, this is FedEx headquarters and TNT. As you can see, these are the buses and uh, all kinds of buses here. All these ones are just waiting for time to be seven o'clock so that they can start loading their buses to go and uh, start their daily jobs. But let me take you guys inside let me take you guys like i said this is fedex headquarters it was tnt before but i don't know what happened they sold it to fedex and now is and now this place belongs to fedex so let's go inside guys but before then let me wear my mask i have to wear this face mask else they won't allow me in Buongiorno ragazzi. So what I do first whenever I arrive is to put my food inside the fridge so it won't get spoiled. So for who doesn't know, FedEx is actually into logistics, okay? All these uh, cartons you are seeing here, everything is waiting to be delivered today, this morning. Okay, this is just a uh, five minutes back, 6 a.m. in the morning. This place is huge, guys, but I cannot take you around because I have to go and start to walk. But I'm just showing you what it looks like, okay? This place is uh, very, very big. I think it's 30,000 meters, okay? So if I said I should take you guys around here, <laughs> even in 10 minutes, I never finish to the worker. So it happens that I, I was one of the people that uh, were actually delivering all these uh, goods you are seeing here. But uh, I resigned the job because it wasn't giving me enough time to go and pick my son from school. Any job that will make me neglect my children, guys, I am going to quit that job. So I was about uh, submitting my resignation letter for this job. When the manager heard that I was about resigning, that was when she called me and said, do you know how long it's going to take you to get another job? And uh, she offered me the job I'm doing right now. So let's go up and uh, let me show you guys what I do right now. And I've been working with them since 2008, guys. So to my calculation, I've been working for 12 years here. But nevertheless, let's go up and let me show you guys what I do. Federica, ti voglio qua subito. Chiama anche Alessandra e venite entrambi che vi voglio parlare. Okay, grazie. So guys, 
If I tell you this is my office, I know you are going to believe it. But you know what? This is not my office. Yes, I work in this place, but this is not my office. And uh, about my YouTube channel, you, my YouTube channel is all about me being real, okay? So I want to be real to the core. Because if I come today and do this video, post like this, go home, everybody will believe that this is what I really do. This is one of my friend's office. She's the manager here. And she's the one that offered me the job I'm talking about because she didn't want me to just go and be looking for another job. And the difference between me and this particular manager here is the amount of money she earns every month. Yes, she might work less and earn more money. I might work more and earn less money. So that's the difference. And uh, thank God for her because she studied so hard to get to this destination. Yeah, I never had the opportunity to do so, but I still thank God that at the end of the month, I'm still able to earn something for myself, okay? So let me take you guys and uh, show you what I really do for a living, okay? Like I said, I work here, but not in this office. This is real life, guys. Let's be real. So this is me right now, guys. This is me right now. As you can see, I have transformed to my real self, okay? I have transformed to my real self. I have to have this mask on, even though the thing is really getting on my nerves because it makes me sweat so much. And this is me okay I'm having my badge here and uh, I'm having my this my bag everything is here okay and this is me okay look at me that is me that is my leg and uh, this is my manager's office where I just sat before and this is my work this is going to be my work guys this place is so so big very very big if i tell you the amount of people that work in this office you won't believe it okay in this office there are 86 people here 86 people okay and uh, my job here is to clean everything to put everything in order clean 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 that is what i do guys that is my job and like I said, I am not ashamed of what I do, okay? I do a clean job. I earn my money, okay? Yes, I would have loved to be a manager for a day. Let's start the cleaning, you know. Let's start the cleaning, guys. Let's start the cleaning. Okay? This, is, this is my cleaning bucket. This is it. And I'm going to start right away from my manager's office before she comes. Because here, they normally resume by 8.30. So, I have to be very very fast i wasted a lot of time this morning already i have to be out of this place by nine o'clock because by nine o'clock they will start arriving so this place is actually divided into three parts this is the call center it's very very big this is the call center we have the commercial center and we have also have a, a i will show you guys anyway i will show you when we go down so let me start doing my work i beg time don't go Today I'm going to be very late here yeah, because of this video. Though yesterday I took my time to do the cleaning because I knew that I would be doing this video today. So I won't be doing much today at all. So my work here is to make sure that their decks are clean, their computers, their keyboards, everything. And believe me, these people, they have become so obsessed with this cleaning issue ever since the pandemic started. And uh, we are using a special product. This is what I use. Like I said, I have to be out of this place by 9 o'clock, latest 9.05, because I still have other places to do. And uh, this is the call center. They don't want any disturbance here. So that's why I start 6 o'clock in the morning. So guys, just be, take, just be looking at me and you will see what I do here until I finish everything. Believe me, it's not easy. Eh? Like I said, I dedicated more time here yesterday because I know I will be filming this video today, so I didn't want to waste much time. You have to make sure that everywhere is clean and this place is really, really big. I cannot come and kill myself. I do the three hours here, then I go to the other side because I still have other two places 
like I said, the place is divided into three parts. And this is the call center. Just keep watching, guys. Keep watching me. So what I really do is I, I take their mouse, make sure I clean it very well because everybody is so afraid right now of contacting this disease. After which I clean the computer, clean the keyboard and the, their desk. I empty their dustbin and uh, wash the bedroom, uh, sweep the floor and uh, clean with mop. Mop the floor. Though I don't mop the floor every day. So when you are doing a job like mine, you don't give them the impression that you can finish everything with the hours they give you. Otherwise, they will keep on bringing jobs, thinking that you are not doing anything. So don't ever give them the impression that you can finish the job they give you within that hour. So this place now brain meets brain, eh? So we started using a paper that is this is tissue paper but it's not the type you see in the bedroom so we started using it ever since the pandemic started because they want something you can use and they throw it away immediately so that uh, all the bacteria will go along with the papers so since March we've been using papers before we are using normal stuff okay the one that you can wash after using this is their dining area as you can see we have some papers Label uh, the chairs, and that's because we are still practicing our social distancing. So, anywhere you are seeing paper, it means that nobody is supposed to be sitting there. Like I said, there are 86 people here, 86 people, and they, they, are, they are not eating together. They divided themselves in, I think, in four groups or five groups, if I'm not mistaken, so that uh, everybody will be sitting afar from each other. So, like I said, I just finished the other side. So, I'm going to clean this place and then I go to the bedroom. Guys, it's almost 9 o'clock and I'm here to finish. This is the meeting room. This place, I think I clean it just twice a week because they don't have meeting all the time. So, but once in a while, I just come in here to take a look at and see if there is any dirt that I can remove from here. So you see what I was talking about before, eh? Look at everybody's busy loading his or her bus, about to go and deliver their goods. So I just finished from the other side, ciao! And uh, I'm about going to the other place as well. And uh, if you can see, everybody is busy loading his or her boards to go and uh, deliver. All those things you order and you see people delivering it to you, most of them are coming from this place. So my work at the commercial center continues. The place might look small, but uh, <laughs> office full this place, guys. That is why I say don't give them the impression that you can finish everything within the hours they give you. So, use your brain. Everywhere is office. These are the bedrooms. I'll be doing that later. This is their dining area.
Everyone here, they try to eat group by group. Though there are not many people here because most of them are working from home. So in this commercial area, I, I just try to dedicate just an hour here because it's not as big as the court center. Let's go down because I just finished from this place now. So this is where the remaining three hours work is going to be happening. Yeah, my work is seven hours a day, sometimes even eight hours, but for now it's seven hours. And this is the only place I can actually relax and do my work with uh, calm because all of them are in the, in the magazine right now doing one thing or the other. So I can work with calm here. So if you are hearing a lot of voices, it's because people work here. So the time is 11 o'clock a.m. and uh, I'm about to have my breakfast. These are melon and watermelon. And I'm having a a cup of cappuccino and I'm here playing someone's playlist as well so I always come up with this tablet because I want to be in control of of the playlist that I'm playing so so what I normally do in times when I'm eating is like I call my children to know how they are feeling because I know that by now my husband is at work he starts work by 8 o'clock in the morning so the children are home so when I'm eating, I just give them a call and know how they're feeling. So come and eat. Let's eat, let's eat. So guys, I am done working, okay? This is after one. This is seven minutes after one. Look at the warehouse I was showing you guys this morning. You can see how empty it is now because a lot of things has gone to its destinations. Ah, ciao. Trentanto fire. Adesso vado a lasciare questo e poi arrivo. And this place, this morning when I arrived, everywhere was was filled up with buses. See? Everybody has gone to do his job this morning. They have all gone to deliver their goods. The small buses you are seeing here are the ones that work at night. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. See, we'll see you again. Ciao, ciao.